Despite his tragic upbringing, one too common for hundreds of thousands of children today, Raiden was able to overcome his traumatic past as he faced his foster father in battle. Joining forces with Solid Snake, they cornered Solidus. With all other options exhausted, Solidus played his trump card, activating a titanic metal gear that had been disguised as the big shell, Arsenal Gear. The coordinates were set. Arsenal Gear was headed for New York City. Raising his voice with a mighty cry, Solidus was ultimately felled by Raiden's blade. But Raiden soon found he wasn't Solidus's true enemy. The third snake was in reality revolting against those who sought to control him, the Patriots. Having learned the truth, Raiden vanished into the streets of New York City, joining Solid Snake, the sole survivor of his line, in the hunt for the real enemy. But the mission for this snake was far from over. I first stumbled across the Patriots while tracking Solid Snake, learning of their true role as puppeteers tugging at America's strings. Now they're pursuing a new plan, extending their influence across the globe by taking total control of war. War has changed. ID-tagged soldiers carry ID-tagged weapons and use ID-tagged gear. Nanomachines inside their bodies enhance and regulate their abilities. Everything is managed and controlled. Having killed his own kin, what remains for the sole surviving snake? His father's blood. His curse eats away at it from the inside. What fate awaits this greying dog of war? His final mission is about to begin. And I will follow him until the bitter end.